Enggak ada mungkin yang tolong kamu. Oh, Sam. Are you kidding me? Andy, Randall, what was that? Nothing, Mom. Everything's fine. What are you doing? Come on, Randall. Be cool. Mom doesn't have to know. Andy, I cannot believe you. You know you're not supposed to open that till tomorrow. But, Mom, can't we just open them now? I mean, it is Christmas Eve. Please, please, okay. please. If I let you do this, you promise to eat all your vegetables? No complaints? Fine. <laughs> okay, come on. Is this a gift card? Cash. Please let this be cash. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Okay, card, card, card. <clears throat> a donation has been made in your name to the Children's Charity of Los Angeles. What the heck is this? I thought this year, instead of giving gifts like we normally do, we could give back. So I made a donation in each of your names to the children's charity that's a few blocks over. Isn't that great? <laughs> that was a good one, Mom. Woo. You had me there. Oh, okay, now. Where are the real presents? I know you had to pin them somewhere. Andy, there aren't any other presents. This is your gift this year, to be able to give to others. Uh Tomorrow we'll go visit the charity and you can see what a difference you've made in all these kids' lives. That actually sounds nice. See? What? No, it doesn't. Well, what about the gift cards? The, 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 the cash? Or the switch I asked for? You have got a roof over your head, food on the table, and your health. Instead of wanting more stuff, wouldn't you rather give to some other child in need? But I am a child in need. A child in need of some cash! Ugh, this is exactly why we are doing things differently this year. You know, while you're complaining about all the stuff you don't have, there is someone out there who is wishing for all the things that you do have. So if you want nice things, you can take more responsibility and earn them. Okay? There's no way I'm gonna accept this. One way or another, she's going to give us our presents. Should have eaten your veggies. After what mom did, I ain't ever eating them again, based on principle. I still can't believe what she did. Not even a stocking stuff. Not a zilch. Yeah, but we do get to make all their kids happy. It's not that bad. You still have a lot of nice things. Yeah, but you know what I don't have? A switch. And worst of all, other kids will be opening my presents on Christmas instead of me. I'm gonna try to ride all along. I should do what he did. Steal presents and destroy Christmas? Hold on a sec. That's it. Randall. Genius. That's exactly what I'll do. What? Ruin Christmas. I mean, if we can't have presents, then no one should. Especially not those kids. Are you saying you want to steal gifts from kids in need? That's wrong on so many levels. Why? There's nothing wrong with taking back what's ours. It's just one tiny little hiccup. I can't pull it off alone. No, 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 no. You're not dragging me into this. I just need someone to be the lookout. All you have to do is just yell if someone's coming. Sorry, you're on your own. All right, fine. But if I get caught without you, then I'll just tell Mama it was your idea. There is a way higher chance I'll get caught without you. You wouldn't do that. Hey, I'm a kid with nothing to lose. Sure you want to test me? If I were to help you, how do you then plan to pull this off? Well, when Mom goes to sleep tonight, we'll sneak out, walk over to the charity office, and break in. If someone sees us? No problem. 
They think it was the Grinch. <laughs> Luckily, I still have this from last year's Christmas party. And you, good sir, can be Santa's elf. I don't want to be an elf. Well, you have no choice. That is, unless you want to get caught. All right, boys. I am calling it a night. What's going on in here? Uh, nothing. Just getting into that Christmas spirit. You're getting into the Christmas spirit by dressing up as the Grinch? Uh-huh. You do remember what the Grinch did, don't you? <laughs> okay, well, whatever. Just don't stay up too late. And put your dirty laundry in the hamper before you go to bed, please. It's disgusting. Good night. Put your dirty laundry away. Annoying. You're then starting to sound like the Grinch. Well then. It's time to take back Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, coast is clear. This is so God. What are we supposed to do now? Shoot, shoot. I don't know. Let me think. Let me think. Oh, I got an idea. Wait over here. Wait over there. Okay, that should buy us some time. Just a sign. Let's go home before we get in trouble. No, we can't. Randall, we've already come this far. There's gotta be a way. Someone's coming, come on! We're doomed! All right, let's go. How can we just gotten caught? Get in there. Randall, stay here. Keep watch. Got work to do. Let's open these presents before mom comes. Morning, boys. Merry Christmas. We have to leave for the children's center. I asked you to put these away. You know you have to put them in the hamper. No, 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 mom. I'll do it. Okay. I mean, at this point, I'm already here. And mom, I just mom, wait, 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 no, no, no. I have to take responsibility. 
<laughs> you have to take responsibility. Are you sure you're my child? Yes, Mom. Remember what you said last night. I have to take responsibility for the things I want. <laughs> well, I'll be. It is a Christmas miracle. Oh, I think I just felt my little heart grow three sizes. Anyway, hurry up and get in the shower. We are leaving in 10 minutes. Oh. That was a close one. Don't relax yet. You have no idea what they're going to do when they see what you did. What in the world? Someone came and stole all the presents Santa brought us. We just came in this morning, and it was like this. Someone must have broken last night. Everything is destroyed. They ate the food, and even the presents were stolen. That's horrible. I mean, what kind of a monster would do something like this? I know who. Santa? You do? Yeah. Someone on the naughty list, that's who. The person who did this deserves coal for Christmas. We're trying to get the security footage, but either way, it looks like Christmas is canceled this year. I'm so sorry, kids. We're gonna try to make next year extra special. Yeah. You even feel a little bad? Be a little. Get over it. So I still have all my presents at home. Hey, Andy, Randall, there is something that I need to show you guys. You come with me? So I didn't want to mention this inside, but there is something that I need to talk to you two about. Okay, what? You got us presents! Yeah. I lied before when I said I didn't get you guys anything. I just wanted to see how you were going to react to the whole giving spirit thing. But I feel like you're really trying to take responsibility. So, go ahead and open them. Yes! No way! A switch? Get to Apple Watch! What? Wait, there's more. Ready? A gift card? And cash? This is the best Christmas ever! Thanks, Mom! Mm -mm -mm. You're welcome. I just feel so bad that those other kids aren't gonna get their gifts. You know, I got Alex a Switch, the one in the wheelchair. She loves playing soccer, but ever since her accident, she hasn't been able to play. That's so sad. Yeah. I thought maybe at least she could play a soccer video game and that might make her feel better. And Blake won't get her Nike gift card. I thought it'd be nice for her to finally get some new clothes after she lost everything in a fire. She always wears the same thing. Really? Yeah. And Billy won't get his cash. Poor kid. I heard there's some nights he doesn't even get to eat anything because his family doesn't have enough money. Anyway. I'm glad you two get to enjoy your Christmas, at least. <laughs> we should get going. Wait. Yeah? I don't need this. What's wrong? Didn't I get the right one? You did. It is. I just feel bad that we get presents and the other kids don't. I also don't need this gift card. And the Apple Watch or cash. Yeah, so if it's okay with you, can we give our presents to the other kids? Wow. Are you sure? Yeah. I realize now that while I've been complaining about all the stuff I don't have, there's kids out there like them wishing for the things we do have. I can't believe I never saw this before. I'm so proud of you too. All right, let's go make their Christmas. Where's all this coming from? I just felt bad. Besides, we've already got all this stuff plus more back in my closet waiting for us. Hey. 
Hey, what are you still doing here? I thought you were leaving. Well, we were, but my boys wanted to spread a little Christmas cheer and give their presents away. Well, that is very thoughtful. Well, I guess Christmas isn't ruined after all, kids. <laughs> yeah. Here's a switch for you, so you can play FIFA on it. Thank you so much. Here's a gift card. Thank you. And here's an Apple Watch. And plus to that, a hundred dollar bill so you can buy food. Oh, oh my gosh. I gotta say, you boys have the biggest hearts. I wish more kids were like you. It's nothing, just trying to spread some Christmas cheer. <laughs> Why don't we stop for some pie on the way? Yeah! And maybe some eggnog? No. Please, no eggnog. Oh, I almost forgot to say, I just spoke to the security company and you're never gonna believe what happened. What? what? So the camera went offline and we have absolutely no footage. Huh. It's too bad. You guys find the bad guys. Fuck. I think I may have found a clue. Whoever did it was wearing a Grinch costume. A Grinch costume? Andy. Yes, 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 they have it in stock, please. Mom, 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 can you please get this for me? Don't you already have an Xbox? No, 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 this is a PlayStation. It's completely different. I mean, come on, please. I, this will be my Christmas present. Mm. Let's see. $500? No way, Troy, that's too expensive. You know, I don't have a job right now. Come on. Dad would get this for me in a heartbeat. You know what? Just, just forget it. I'll, I'll just ask Dad to get for me. Don't be that way, Troy. How about Foculus? Didn't you say you wanted one? You did, right? Not as much as a PS5. I know, but it's two hundred dollars cheaper, and this is still a really nice Christmas gift, huh? Yeah, whatever. It's fine. Look, I'll be waiting outside. Try not to get too excited. Hello. Happy holidays. Happy. That's what you want to call it, sure. By chance, are you guys hiring? No, sorry. Yeah. That'll be $322.92. Okay. There aren't any coupons or anything, are there? Unfortunately not. All right, here you go. Oh, hold on, sorry. I'm sorry, it says insufficient funds. Do you have another card you can try or cash? Uh, let me see. Um. You could apply for a store credit card. No, that's all right. Um, I don't want to dig deeper in debt, you know. Uh, would it be okay if I use cash and then put the rest on my card? Sure. Um, how much would you like me to put on the card? Let me see. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna put two sixty-five on the card. Okay. And two four six sixty in cash. Okay. 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 It went through. Oh, <laughs> great. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's your change. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Would you like a bag? Sure. It's 25 cents. Uh, oh. that's all right. Don't worry about it. Thank you. You know what? I'll take care of it. Happy holidays. Are you excited about your game system? Yes. 
Shoot. Nah, we gotta go back. For what? It says it doesn't include a carrying case. Can you believe it? What do you need a carrying case for? You could just use the box. What? No, no, I can't bring this to my friend's house in the box. That looks so cheap. Come on, Troy. Now, I just spent a lot of money. Forget it. I'll just ask Dad. Your favorite line. All right, how much is the case? I don't know, like 20 bucks. All right, let's go. Wait, I don't want to carry this around. Let me put this in the car. Next. You happy now? <laughs> hey, where's my car? This, this is where I parked, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, isn't that our car? Oh my gosh. <sighs> My Oculus is in there. Hey! That's my car! Stop! Hey! Stop! Stop! Please! Hey. Hi, um, do you work here? Yes, ma'am. Um, did you call the tow truck? No, ma'am. That's parking enforcement. I'm just a security guard. Why did they tow my car and instead of just giving me a ticket? I'm not sure, but usually when that happens, it's because you have unpaid registration. You didn't pay your registration? Seriously? Why? Things have been complicated. Complicated? Okay, so what are we gonna do now? I don't know. Okay, just give me a second. Do you know where they are taking my car? Yeah, it's 1020 High Street. It's about four miles up the road. Four miles? Do you um, think you could give us a ride? I'm sorry, I can't. I could, I could, I could lose my job. Good luck. Okay, look. How about I just call No, Dad. no, do not call him. I just call grandma. Just give me a minute. Hey, sweetheart, I'm at work. Are you okay? Yeah, um, I'm here with Troy at the plaza and my car got towed. <laughs> You think you could pick us up? No, sweetheart, no. I'm in a meeting with my boss. We're going over a real estate deal. We're about to close. Can you call an Uber? Um, I don't have any money. And honestly, I won't be able to get my car back. I'm just trying to get Troy his Christmas present that was in there. Okay, I'll call you an Uber. Uh, you're in the plaza parking lot? No, no, you don't have to do that. You've already done so much for us lately, so. We can just walk. And um, it's not that far, so. Okay, good luck. Thanks, Ma. I'll see you at home. I love you. All right. Sorry about that. It's all right. Is everything okay? My daughter's just going through some hard times. It'll be okay. Oh no. Well, if there's anything I can do to help, just let me know. Thank you. <laughs> You're the best. <laughs> Thanks. <sighs> what were you doing? 
Look, I called Dad to pick us up. He's already on the way. Why would you do that? Hmm? I told you not to call him. Look, I don't see what the big deal is. Plus, I mean, what else are we gonna do? We're gonna walk. That's what we're gonna do. Now text him and tell him not to come. No. No, 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 wait. No, I'm not walking that far. Hey, I'm being serious. <sighs> why is it so far and why do we have to walk? You want your Oculus back again, right? We don't have any other choice, okay? I still don't get why you won't just let Dad help us. Please, stop asking me that. You know, up until a month ago, everything was fine. And then all of a sudden, we moved in with Grandma, and you and Dad stopped talking, and, and you guys stopped working together. I mean, it doesn't make any sense. Troy, please. It's better for you if you don't know, OK? Now, we're not far from Here's me. Dad. I told you to text him not to come. Oh. <laughs> hey. Hey, Tiffany. I thought my dad was picking me up. Yeah, he got tied up in a meeting, so I offered to come. Ah. Uh -huh. Thanks. Uh, would you mind taking my mom and I to the tow lot? Yeah, that's fine. Hop in. <sighs> okay, one sec. Uh, hey, mom. It's not Dad, it's just his secretary, so it's fine. Come on, let's go. I am not getting in that car. Come on, I don't see what the big deal is, okay? It's just- No! I am not getting in that car! Well, I'm not walking. So if you don't wanna go, then I'll just go to Dad's office and have him drop me off at Grandma's later. You coming? Fine. See you later. Hello? Well, if you didn't want to pay $300, then maybe you shouldn't have parked in the rent. I can't believe these people. Mm-hmm. Can I help you? Uh, hi. Um, my car got towed earlier. It's a gray Nissan Sentra. Oh, yeah, yeah. You called earlier, right? No. Um, listen, I'm not actually here to even get my car. I want to know, would it be all right if I could leave it here just for a while, you know, until I can get together the $300 to pay for the tow? That's just the minimum. It's $50 a day after that. What? Seriously? Yeah, you can't just park here for free. <laughs> I never wanted to park here. And I didn't want to come to work today, but yet, here we are. <laughs> um, how do I get to my car? I, I need to get something out of it. You can't access your vehicle until you pay. What? Oh, come on. Come on, my son's Christmas present is in there, please. Look, it's company policy. There's nothing I can do. But if you didn't want your car towed, you shouldn't have left it in the red. Oh, she didn't park in the red. An expired meter. Oh, then why'd you tow her? Unpaid registration. Ah. Are you the one who towed my car? Yep. If you saw me, then why didn't you stop? You know, I try to avoid altercations with customers. They tend to get a little hysterical. This is your car? You did call earlier. No, it wasn't me. Well, somebody did. Whatever. Anyway, your fee's already been paid in full over the phone. Oh my gosh. Really? I guess you have a guardian angel. <laughs> Will you take it to her car? Uh. Follow me. Hello? 
Hello? You thief stole my car, Whoa, 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 whoa. Better drop that attitude and try again. I can't believe these people. Right. There's your car. Have a nice day. Thanks. Hey, wait! Someone broke into my car! And they stole my son's Christmas gift! Yeah. Whew. Oh, you know, this isn't the safest place for parking. I never parked here. You took it here. Well, you should have paid your parking meter. There's nothing I could do. We're not responsible. Company policy. Company. You guys, company policy sucks! Yeah, I know. Oh, this is happening to me. You didn't have to pay for me, you know. I would have figured something out. I know, but you're already going through so much. And I just wanted to help. Well, thanks. And I appreciate it. And I promise that as soon as I get a job, I'm gonna pay you back all the money you spent on us, okay? Sweetheart, that should be the last of your worries. Where's Troy? I just got home, I haven't seen him yet. Okay. Why don't we just have some tea? Whoa! Wait, what are you doing with that? I am going to buy Troy another Christmas present. Uh, wait, no, no, no. That's your savings so you can get your real estate license. I know, I know, that was the plan, but now I need to buy no, Troy no, no. a Christmas no, present. No, do not break into that. How much do you need? No, Mom, absolutely no. not. I am not letting you spend any more money on us. No, it's not that big. Why did you break into that? That was all the savings you had. If you were in my situation, would you not do the same thing for me? Yes. Now, if you want to help me, you can help me count this money. <laughs> okay. Come here. Come here. Okay. All this messy money. <laughs> a lot of it though. <laughs> Five? Yeah. How <laughs> in the world? Dad took me to get it before he dropped me off. Look, 
I told you you'd buy it for me. And what about your Oculus? Oh. Look, I don't care about that. You can just, I don't know, leave it on the floor. What are you crying about now? Mom. Do you have any idea what I went through to get you a present? I pretty much spent my last dollar. Okay. Well, I told you what I really liked from the beginning. So it's not my fault that you couldn't afford to give me what I really wanted for Christmas. You know, Dad told me. Why you guys split up? Oh yeah. And what did he say? Basically, that it was all your fault. That you broke up this family. Is that true? If that's what you want to believe, Troy, then that's fine. I want to go live with Dad. Won't be here anymore. You can make your own decisions, Troy. I'm not gonna stop you. You know you can't always believe everything your dad says. Well, what am I supposed to do? My mom won't tell me anything. That's because she cares more about your feelings than her own. What, what are you talking about? The reason she isn't saying anything it's because she doesn't want you to think any less of your father. You see, your mom has always done her best to take care of everyone around her. On top of trying to be the best mother and the best wife, she also sacrificed her own career to help build your dad's business. Even though it's because of her, the whole office ran. He never really appreciated your mom and would keep everything to himself. She was just too nice to complain. Then a few weeks ago, on your dad's birthday, he didn't come home because he was working late at the office. So she decided to surprise him. Little did she know that she would be getting the surprise when she walked into your dad's office there he was cheating on her with the secretary she couldn't believe it and to make things even worse your dad didn't even feel bad at all. He told her if she left, he would take away her car, cut off all her spending, and that she would be left with nothing. As hard as it was, 
your mom stood her ground and decided to walk away anyway. So you see, that's the real reason why your parents separated. Oh my gosh. Oh, I, I mean, I, I can't believe you did that to her. Man, why wouldn't she just tell me? Because as badly as he hurt her, she didn't want you to hate your dad. That's how big her heart is. This whole time, I thought it was all her fault. Gosh, I can't believe I got in the car with Tiffany. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't blame yourself. You didn't know. But now that you do know... Mom. told me everything. I'm so sorry about everything. <laughs> I've never gotten in that car earlier if I had no mom. Oh, I know, baby. I know you would. I know. Ooh, this is the office. I gotta take this. Hey, look. Look, I can return the PS5 and then you can use that money. Pay no, back. no, you don't have to return it. And even if you decide to, all that money is yours. Because I don't want anything to do with your dad's money. Okay, then what are you gonna do? I mean, Grandma, she told me that, that I took, like, everything. I, I, I don't know, <laughs> but I'm gonna figure out a way to... Can you repeat what you just said one more time? You're on speakerphone. Your daughter seems like an extremely capable young woman. We'd love to give her the office manager position if she's interested. <laughs> Hold on a second. It's my boss. They want to offer you a position. You start right away, it pays well. And they're even going to cover the costs of your real estate license. Oh, <gasps> really? <laughs> What, how does she even know I was looking? I might have been in and out of the air telling them how capable you were. Whoa. Oh, wow. Mom. Thank you. I, I, I appreciate it. Well, you're going to take the position? Oh. <laughs> yes, she's going to accept the position. <laughs> Yay! I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, so are we. Thank you. You're welcome. Happy holidays. Happy, Happy holidays! holidays. <laughs> <laughs> now I want you to know that my first check is going to you to start paying you back for everything. Nonsense. You don't owe me anything. Mama, please. Mmm. No. Hey, Troy. What? <laughs> Are you making Christmas cookies? <laughs> yeah. What do you guys think? Uh, they look delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Better than the ones I make. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. And I have one more surprise. Here. What is it? <laughs> You'll see. Open it. <laughs> All right. I'll get that. Okay. I'll go get Troy. No, wait. I'm not here to see him. Okay, then why are you here? I'm here to see you. Look, I know things ended really badly between us. But I want to try to make them better. I don't understand. What happened to Tiffany? I caught her charging up the company credit card and even taking money from one of the accounts. It was a big mess. Oh, wow. To be honest, uh, everything kind of went downhill after you left. I guess I didn't realize how much you did for the company, how much you did for me, until you were gone. 
So do you think maybe uh, I can try to get you to come back? So that we can all be a family again. You're welcome to see Troy whenever you want. But as far as you and I, there's no way that could ever happen again. Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey, Troy. Um, Want to spend Christmas with your pop? Uh, spend it with mom and grandma. And I want to give you this back. I thought this is what you wanted. It was, but not anymore. Appreciate it, though. All right. Well, I get to see you on New Year's. Uh, maybe. All right, um, you take care, son. Hmm. Did you really just give your PlayStation back? Yeah. I need to have an Xbox. No, come on. I want you to open it. All right, all right. What have you got in here? Is this? Yeah, I paid your registration and that ticket you got. Merry Christmas. No. No. <laughs> but how did you? I returned my Oculus. No, look, Mom, I promise it's fine. I don't need it. I realize it. Christmas isn't all about gifts. Oh, so sweetheart. I love you so much. <laughs> love you too. <laughs> Merry Christmas, guys. <laughs> Gosh, that was so much fun. Oh, I love when we get to come out to your mom's cabin, Monica. Yeah, this is the best. Ah! What the heck? I am so sorry. I didn't see you there. Well, maybe be more careful next time. This suit is designer. Not that you would know anything about that. Come on, ladies. It's too cold to be out here. Little jammed him. Let me These see. pigs came out so fire. <gasps> Way better than if we took them on my crappy iPhone. Uh, my mom is about to get me the 14 for Christmas. They're about to be even better. <laughs> Wait, that is so loud. I can't hear. How are we supposed to watch anything with her making all that noise? I'll take care of it. Sorry, I was listening to Doja Cat. Is everything okay? No, you're being too loud. Me and my friends are trying to watch TV. So you're gonna have to use a shovel, okay? Uh, but that's gonna take forever. I'm almost done if you guys wouldn't mind giving me a minute. You're here to work? We're trying to enjoy our winter break. So use a shovel. Got it? Got it. Hey, sweetie, I was gonna boil some hot water for some hot chocolate if you and your girlfriends want some. Um, yeah, thanks, Mom. Hey, Carly, how's it going out here? Good. Why are you not using the snow flower? Uh, it can be pretty loud. I don't want to bother Monica and her friends. Oh, don't be silly. No, 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 they can deal with the noise. They have it good enough. Just go ahead and finish up. Honestly, I don't mind. Are you sure? Okay. Well, if you get cold, come on inside and have some hot chocolate. It'll be ready soon. Thanks, Miss Johnson. Oh, please. Call me Jan. <laughs> hey, girls. 
hot chocolate is ready. Ooh, yes! This looks amazing. Mm -hmm. I wish my mom did stuff like this. Mm. Oh, before I forget, we are running out of firewood. So if you wouldn't mind helping me cut some wood, maybe your friends could help. And I would throw in a hundred dollars. That's horrible. Why don't you ask that other girl to do it? Carly? Yeah, I'm sure she's used to it. She does manual labor. Sorry to bother. Uh, I just finished. Is there anything else you need? Oh, you're not bothering at all. Come on in. Have some hot cocoa. Thanks so much, Dan. I really appreciate it. You know what? Before I forget, would you be interested in maybe chopping some wood? Maybe for the fireplace for a hundred dollars? A hundred bucks? I couldn't take that. That's way too much money. Oh, no, no, no. I insist. I would have given it to Monica anyway. Wow. Okay. I, I could really use the money to help buy Christmas presents, so this is perfect. Thanks. Wow, you buy your own gifts? <laughs> I buy Monica everything she wants, and she still won't even lift a finger. I guess it's because she's an only child, and I probably just spoil her too much. Could you ever see yourself having more kids? Yeah, that was my dream, but just didn't work out with Monica's dad and I. Hey, I bet you are saving up for the new iPhone 14. Oh, no, I have the 7 and it works perfectly fine. I don't need a new phone. Wow, Carly, that's impressive. Your parents raised you right. How about you have some hot cocoa before you finish up and go out and cut some wood? Okay. And if you need any other help around here, don't hesitate to ask. Ugh, I don't want to go back to school, like, at all. Especially to Mrs. Grimm's class. Ugh. Ew! Like, why does a teacher give us work over Christmas? This is so cool. Your mom put this together? What, what are you doing? Uh, I was just gonna get some hot chocolate. Chan said... My mom made this for me and my friends. Last time I checked, you were just here to work. I don't want your dirty little hands in my marshmallows. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, uh, you're right, it's just really cold out, so... Well, then your parents should have gotten you better winter clothes. Um, I'll go get started on that firewood. Wait. I know it's cold out there, so... You can have mine. Thanks, Monica, that's Oops. really... <laughs> <laughs> there goes your hot chocolate. You should probably clean that up. Oh my god. <laughs> god. <laughs> Heads up! Ah! Oh uh, I really wish we had snow on Cali just for this. Same. <laughs> Do you guys want to see something funny? Wait, I don't think you should. Oh, it is. Wait, it's gonna be hilarious though. Ready? Lynn Johnson, what are you doing? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Get your butt over here immediately. Be quiet. I am so sorry. You can stop working. You don't have to keep working here. Don't worry, I'm fine. I can keep working. What in the world are you thinking? Now, come on, Mom. Loosen up. She said she's fine. We're just having some fun. A little fun? Mm-hmm. Well, you're having a little fun, Carly's over here working. You have no idea how hard it is, the work that she does. As if I'd want to. I'm never gonna do manual labor. We're rich. See, that's the issue. I've spoiled you. Now you've become entitled. You know why you have your Christmas gifts handed to you? Carly's over here working for hers. Okay, sucks for her. That's not my problem. Oh, it's not? Okay, well, we're gonna do things a little bit differently from now on, starting right now. Pick up that firewood. What? The only way you'll learn how hard someone else's life is is by walking a mile in their shoes. So for the rest of the trip, I want you to do Carly's work for her. Uh, actually, Miss Johnson, I'm really okay to work. I can't afford to lose out on this job. That's okay. You'll still get paid. Don't worry about that. Because Monica's going to do the work for you. <laughs> no, that's, that's a good one, because I'm going to get back to my friends. 
I'm serious, or you won't get the iPhone 14, or any of the other gifts that you wanted. You're joking. You already ordered it. Oh, I could cancel that at any time. So what's it gonna be? This is so unfair. So what would you like me to do next, Miss Johnson? I want you to come inside and get some hot cocoa while Monica makes a fire for us. Come on, dear. Monica is not happy. For the first time, she's about to learn the meaning of hard work. As she chops firewood, she quickly sees it's not as easy as it looks. She hates that she has to work while everyone else gets to relax and have fun. With Carly gone, she now has to take care of everything herself. And she hates every second of it. She also has to clean the entire cabin, including washing all the dishes, vacuuming all the floors, and even taking out the trash. She now starts to realize just how hard Carly's job really is. <sighs> so, how'd it go? Well, my back hurts, I'm exhausted, and my fingers are frozen. Not the winter break that I imagined at all. Well, I'm proud of you for surviving the torture. <laughs> and as promised, And I didn't wrap it because I already know you already know what it is. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. I have been dying for this. And doesn't it just feel so much better because you earned it? Actually, yeah. You're right. It kind of does. Not that I would ever really want to do it again, though. <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to give Carly her card and her last paycheck. Oh, my friends are gone, though. You're just going to leave me here alone? I'm not going to be gone long. You can come with me if you like. Okay. <laughs> Alex! Blake! No running in the house! I'm so sorry, things are a little hectic. Is there something I can help you with? Um. Oh, bye. Mom! Mom, Lake and Alex broke my toy. I'll fix it, just give me a minute. I'm sorry, uh, what were you saying? I just, we, we just wanted to come by and give Carly a card. I, I didn't realize she had so many siblings. This is actually a foster home. Oh, that means, well, Carly's a foster child. She's a great kid, I, I hope she finds a permanent home soon. Um, Carly, someone's here to see you. Coming. Should be out in a minute. Okay, what did you guys break now? I heard something. <laughs> hey, he guys. Here, let me close this. It'll be quieter. Is it always like mm. this? Stressful. Well, the noise. <laughs> yeah, well, after a while, you get used to it. <laughs> so, what are you guys doing here? Oh, we wanted to come by and bring you your check and a Christmas card, and hopefully you can buy all the gifts that you wanted to buy yourself. <laughs> Thanks so much. Actually, the... Gifts are for my foster brothers and sisters, not for me. You did all that work to get gifts for other people? Mm-hmm. It's the last Christmas I'm gonna spend with them because I have to move homes again. Ugh, I, I had no idea that you were a foster kid. If you don't mind me asking, what happened? And why aren't you adopted yet? Sure. Um, my parents passed away a few years ago in a car accident. And since I'm older, it's a little hard getting adopted. Most people want a younger kid. So I've been bouncing around homes a lot. I am so sorry, Carly. I can't imagine what you're going through. It's OK. Now that it's been a while, I've gotten used to it. And even if I don't get adopted, only a couple more years till I turn 18. So I'll be OK. Carly, I need your help in here. Sorry, I have to go, but I really appreciate this. Let me know if you guys need help with anything before you go back home. Even with packing, I can do it all. <laughs> Take care. What is it? I got it. You were right. 
You never know how hard someone else's life is. Gosh, I cannot stop thinking about it. Oh, that must be Carly. No, Monica, you did not invite her over to help you pack, did you? But that's... Hey, I got your text. Did you guys need help with anything? Yeah, I did. Come on in. Carly, you do not have to help. I need help opening this. Okay, what's in it? Well, I realize I never got you a Christmas gift. So I put all my Christmas money together to get you- Doja Cat tickets? Oh my gosh, I love her. Yeah, me too. So I got enough for all of us to go. Thanks. Uh, but this concert's in LA. There's no way I'd be able to make it all the way over there. Actually, I think you can. Because I got you something, Mom. Oh, wasn't expecting this. What could this be? <laughs> An adoption application. I know how much you've wanted another kid. And I've always wanted a sister. So what do you say? Do you want to be a part of the family? <laughs> really? This is the best Christmas ever. Welcome to the Johnsons, Carly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have to get ready for that concert. I like you, I do. You know, oh, everybody knows Doja Cat. <laughs> I like you, I do. <laughs>